for joining us. This is Lindsay Smith Rosales from Nirvana Grill in Laguna Beach, and I'm here to introduce Uncorked, a food and wine festival that's going to be happening here in Laguna Beach on March 8th through the 11th with the main festival on Saturday, March 10th at the Pageant of the Masters Fairgrounds. So now we're gonna go into the kitchen. Please follow me. We are, and we'll start cooking right away. Some of the lentils, we start with about a tablespoon of butter for an order for about four people. And then for the scallops, we want to get a nice crust on it. And because of our blackening spice, I do use a non-stick pan um, because otherwise it will it will burn too much. So we'll start that one. We use a half extra virgin olive oil and half rapeseed to cook most things within the restaurant. We use very little butter except for to finish something or for vegetables or something like that at the end. And so we're going to get, for one order, five scallops. And um, generally if you're using something like a scallop, I usually, you know, if you have tongs in your kitchen, I, I like a flat tong. You won't bruise the scallops, you'll just kind of cradle them. It's a, a nicer way to, to handle them, being more delicate with them. And then this here is our blackening spice. And as you'll see, there's that really good texture in it that's got, you know, some of those um, nice um, herbs in it that are dried, and then your paprika. We use a nice Hungarian paprika. It's not spicy, but it's got a really nice flavor to it. And so we'll just put about a tablespoon, will be all we'll need, to coat all of them. And just, uh, get enough to get them all covered and we'll just let that sit for a minute and those are the base for our lentils we get those nice and translucent and you'll get that really sweet flavor out of them if you don't get otherwise if you don't cook them enough and then these are our lentils so what we've done is we've steamed them first they're French Pouille lentils um, they're a really nice delicate very plump very uh, meaty flavor to them and uh, it's about uh, you know two tablespoons or so per per person per order. And we just saute those down for a bit. And what I like to do is right before they're done, right when we're putting our herbs in, I have a, a pot here, and we use this pot for all of our vegetables. That's all that goes in here all night. And we use that water to almost poach some of our items in it. So you get that flavor of all the vegetables throughout the evening, flavoring those dishes. So we're having our own stock kind of throughout the evening from all those vegetables. And now we're ready for our scallops. So our oil's quite hot. It dances around in the pan quite nicely. And um, we get those good amount of oil for them because that blackening, it won't stick. It'll just allow us just enough to be able to turn them around there. Get a nice crust on them. And while those are cooking to our lentils, we use some flat leaf parsley, a little bit of chives, a little bit of dried thyme, kosher salt, and some black cracked pepper. And that'll finish off this. And then, like I said, take a little bit of our water, and we just let it steam a little bit in our lentils and that'll keep them nice and tender, not sticking to the pan. And then for our scallops, you'll see that it does turn black in the pan, that's fine. Um, it's just the blackening spice working there. And you get that nice crust on it. Our lentils are done. Our scallops need about a minute more, and we just like to finish them in the pan. So unless you're holding them for something, you could take it at this point, take it off the stove, hold it for you know an hour or so if you were serving guests for courses, and then throw it in a 400 degree oven, finish it off, it's perfect at that point. So uh, we're just about done here. And what we're gonna do is just very, very roughly chop that down, and then we'll steam it for about three or four minutes, makes it really nice and tender. And um, when it's done, then that'll be the base of what we're gonna put down with our um, with our scallops and lentils. And 
we use just a, the, the smallest touch that we can of butter, just enough to give it a little bit of flavor with some salt and pepper after it's steamed there. And uh, that'll be all finishing that fish. So this is a beurre blanc that we make and we're just gonna warm a little bit of that up for the finish of our sauce. So what we're making here is one of the specialties here at Nirvana Grill in Laguna Beach. And it's our day boat scallops that we've used our Nirvana Blackening Spice on, which has a nice earthy and aromatic flavoring to it, not spicy at all. And our French lentil sauteed with some leeks and aromatics, a nice beurre blanc sauce. And we're uh, just finishing off our uh, organic red Swiss chard, and uh, we'll be plating this up here in a second. And we're going to put that down as our base. put our scallops around that and then here we've got our butter and that's just to get it nice and warm again put a little bit of sauce over our scallops each This is a really nice light sauce, lemon, butter, bay leaf, peppercorn, shallots, cream. It's a very nice, nice thing to serve with many different uh, dishes. It just marries very well to, to different things. And you can make adjustments to it to fit more than just that one item. Give a little bit of salt and pepper. put that on top to uh, finish off that dish. So you can see that really nice bright color. It's kind of got that sweetness like uh, beets do and it's got that nice spinach uh, like texture to it. Great, great green to use. And so that is our Nirvana blackened scallops with lentils and organic Swiss chard.